Hello everyone, welcome to the Sims 4 with Hunch Baby Challenge. Part 36. So, Fred and Naboya have decided it's time for them to move out. They would like to move out into their own apartment. Maybe they'll move to the apartment next door. And Christy agrees. They have enough money. They have the best stuff ever. He, they have the this uh, custom content stove is actually better than the one you get work. So, so we're gonna have a dinner party, kind of celebrate it, even though it seems silly. It's like we're gonna celebrate that they're finally moving out into their own. <laughs> but Naboya actually has something else in mind. So he requested that they kind of do have a, a, a dinner party, even though, you know, it's like, why? Let's see, is he really here? Kevin. It'd be great if I could just alphabeticalize these. How do you know the, oh, that's right. You had to invite, oh, that's right. We never got to that. Oh, well. Peterson, 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 Peterson. Oops, that's all the kids that moved out? Only four? Wait. Where's Eric? Uh... What the... I have no idea where Eric is, but we're gonna invite over. Oh, there you are. That's weird. No, we don't need to invite over the kids who are still not, who are actually living here. Okay, so that's all the friends you know. All right. We don't need an entertainer. It's all just an, of course, caterer is going. What? Okay, we're not gonna. Nope. We're not gonna do that either. Oh, crud. I keep forgetting how. Ugh. I have to do the calendar. Oh well. Well, that's okay. Dinner party! I'll just continue my role as. the caterer, even though I'm not assigned to one, assigned to be it, apparently. Let's work on. We want to make this a big fancy thing, so we're gonna make a gourmet meal. Another Caesar salad. Okay, there's stuff breaking. Let me find out what's broken so I can tell her to fix it. Repair. Use. Kid, get out of here. Really? Go. Scram. Uh, aren't you supposed to be coming... Okay, why is my daughter offering me a job? A business world? Hmm, interesting. I wonder if she actually works there or not. Do I seriously have to invite them all in? Thanks for coming. Thanks for coming. Hello? You guys are gonna make this so bad, aren't you? Hello, landlord dude. Thanks for coming. Not mischief. And romantic, not mischief. Stop doing the mischief. So we're gonna wait a little bit. Oh, and the TV's broken too. Seriously. Oh, that's okay. We're gonna wait a little bit. Needs a friend. All right, let's get these two out of the conversation. Oh, I thought there was a way to. Oh, I'll have to. You yeah, had the conversation, guys. You yeah, had the conversation. Whatever. So, of course, if I say go here together, the whole. Everyone. Unbelievable. Alright. He just wants to do a bar. You know, this is a good- Oh, someone made a mess. Lovely. This is a good 
let's see. You know, it'd be great if we could do like some toast or something first. To be like, or some speech. We like do some speech. Like, hey, I want to do something. He starts talking about um Fred, like how much he loves him and stuff. And then he does it. That'd be great. But all I could do, and then and like, everybody's watching. That'd be great. You know what? No. Uh oh. Did their? Don't tell me their relationship fell out. Oh no. Okay. There we go. <laughs> That really would be great if the, if everybody be like, oh my god, he's proposing. <laughs> Seriously? Serba, you may. Huh? He is. And he's playful after that. Everybody's just see. Everybody's just like, oh whatever. There, he's proposing to a brother. And he said yes. <laughs> Harry is a bit cause, uh, occupied right now. Yeah, you're gonna miss the you're scout meeting. Uh, your brother, today. older one of your Simone older brothers, just got <laughs> just got Point engaged, and, and they're moving oh, out soon. So, so really, oh. you guys got up way too early again. Not is I wish yeah. 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 It's gonna be great if I literally could have been like, hey, you guys, watch I let you know. Do some kind of speech and be like, I want to ask him to marry me. Because right now it's just, it's like, oh, we could have done this without the party, but. But also he's a party animal, so he probably would have been like one of those sims to go over the top. Like, oh, I have to. I love partying, so I have to have a party for this. Do I really have to tell you to go pay pay? Don't tell me all the toilets are broken. Lovely. There you go. Use toilet. You're all focused. Eat. Grab a serving. Be happy. You got a serving of food. Okay, good. It's more like, well, it kind of is a party with everybody talking to each other with the older siblings. But then some of them are like, eh, it's just a normal day. Oh, I'm just going to carry on with my life. Like her. <laughs> Did you master your trick? Your uh, no. Oh, now you gotta play an instrument and all five play put your type. Well, I can definitely not have to master your. Well, how long before you age up? Well, I guess it doesn't matter. Be student and and we have two days. If we had school today, then probably Harry would be able to move out, so we could definitely have triplets. But these two, uh, surprise, uh, they actually aged up into adults, which I didn't know that because of this mod. So they're like, look, we we're now adults. We really need to get our own life together, mom. Work well, so Fred. The boy is probably like, ma'am. I gave you a lot of money. I gave you a great kitchen. It's time for me to live my own life with my boyfriend. Uh, now, fiance. Now, I'm just kind of waiting for this party to end so I can have them move out. <laughs> and I've decided, even though I, I really like to have the idea of actually getting the kids' life started, like with the whole relationship and stuff. It's like, I'll be doing this every other part, probably, or every two parts, depending on how fast we get these kids to age up, so it's like, no, that's why I really wish we had a little more story progression, where it's like, okay, so the, the families that are, so you can be like, okay, one day, like, maybe ten episodes later, and be like, oh, you, you're married? You have a child now? Oh, wow, wow. Instead of me having to arrange all that. I mean, even the kids that Harry, no, I mean, Harry knows are still kids. While he is, uh, where are you? Yeah, the kid with the hat. While he's half, oh, almost halfway through his teenagehood. So, I love how they bounce up, just jump up. Oh yeah, we invited Mr. Na Mr. Neighbor. <laughs> Mr. Landlord over, is that him? Let's go ahead and build up the floor this so when I when these two move out, that I, we can just go right to having a kid. Or twins as much as, as, as much as the twins were much to pay me ass. Have our last 
Pregnancy probably by the time. I don't know. <laughs> She's like watching mom like, oh great, mom's trying to have more kids. While ignoring how... Oh, I must have Fred. Jack! Is, uh, see, it's like creative, but then it ruins their mo what is it, responsibility? So. I was gonna say, don't tell me she proposed to someone. I didn't know that. Oh, damn it! Pay, take pay time off. This is like a. What? <laughs> Strange. I don't know why. Apparently, he's uncomfortable with having doing this in the party. I don't know. Parenting. Discipline. Strict. I'm sorry, mommy. And now you're gonna clean up the mess. All right, party's just about over. I'm gonna end this part here. Thank you for watching. I hope you were enjoying this challenge. The, um. They're all set with money and stuff, so they're gonna let Fred go. I might go ahead and do a part with their wedding, just you know, just because how uh, they've been involved in this family past a, a aging up into an adult. But okay, now the game's like just made everybody freeze. Yeah. Anyway, I hope you were enjoying this, and I will see you in the next video.